the Jewish community here. Um, right now we have some more greetings to bring up. Everyone knows UJA. UJA has a lot of people working there. They do a lot of things. They oversee so many programs. And the person at UJA who is the chief program officer of UJA Federation of Greater Toronto is the man here who is coming up right now. Please give a warm welcome to Daniel Held. What a pleasure to be here tonight. I have to start by saying, as I think every morning, my heart is in the East and I am here in Toronto thinking about our brothers, our sisters, our aunts, our uncles, our cousins, our family in Israel, and thinking every day, bring them home, bring our brothers home, bring our sisters home, bring the hostages home now. Most of the holidays that we celebrate are holidays that we celebrate at home or in synagogue. We make a Seder at home. We build a sukkah in our backyards. We spend Rosh Hashanah and Yom Kippur in synagogue. But there's a special commandment for, um, for Hanukkah, Pyusuma Nisa, to be out there in public, to share the joy, to celebrate the miracle publicly and with the world. And I think especially today, especially in the context of rising anti-Semitism, growing hate, a community that feels threatened every day. It is especially important for us to be standing here publicly, in the public square, celebrating who we are, celebrating our identity, and saying, we will not give in to hate. We will not give in to anti-Semitism. We will celebrate our piece, our little stone of the cultural mosaic of Canada, and be who we are. And I think... When I think about the world of Federation and what we want to be in the community and the way that we want to celebrate our identity, that is essential to being able to be part of Toronto, part of Ontario, part of Canada, part of what it means to be in a multicultural society by everyone being able to proudly say who they are. And that's the message of Hanukkah. So I want to end with a word of Hakarat Hatov, thanking everyone who made tonight come to life. I want to thank 
Firstly, the Song Shul and the Spiros for making tonight happen. I want to thank Toronto Police for protecting us day in and day out. The way you have been with us since October 7th and long before is critical. And I want to thank all of you for being here today because us being on the streets and proudly saying who we are is essential to the strength of our community today and into the future. Thank you. Thank you so much, Daniel Held. Okay, who's ready for some Motown? <laughs>